Dave, thanks for joining us. We'll run through this week's injury report. We might start off with uh, Chris Dawes, who's still uh, battling a little bit, but uh, hopefully in a couple of weeks. How's he going? Yeah, look, he's had a, a really good week in rehab. Uh, obviously, being a recurrence, we're going to play pretty conservative, so he probably won't be this week, but uh, we hope that he'll play next week. Lyndon Dunn's got the hamstring. How's he tracking? Yeah, look, both him and Joel McDonald, similar injuries. Uh, they've you know, been going really well for a couple of weeks now. Um, they'll be a test for this week. Tom Couch was a uh, withdrawal in the VFL. Can you explain yeah, what Yeah, look, he just had a severe bout of gastro on the morning of the game. So, um, yeah, we pulled him out, but look, we expect him to play this week. Tom Gillies um, missed with a groin uh, from last week's side? Yeah, uh, he's pulled up pretty well. Uh, again, he's going to be a test on you know Thursday and Saturday, but again, we expect him to play. A couple of the younger guys, uh, Nathan Stark and Jack Fitzpatrick, how are they going? Yeah, Stark, he's good. He'll train with the group on Thursday. You know, we'd expect him to play in the VFL. Um, and Fitzy just had some concussion symptoms uh, again that you know just reported them in the very last session before the game. Uh, so we played a conservative line and pulled him there. But look, we expect him to play this week. Jordan McKenzie's just had a calf problem the last couple of weeks. Um, where's he at? Yeah, look, he, round one he got a really severe cork and um, and it really sort of blew up. You know, had a lot of swelling. Um, he obviously kept playing on it, which probably made it worse. Um, he was pretty close for round two, but after a training session, it blew up again. Um, so he's trained today and, and got through pretty well, uh, but, and we expect him to, to train and play this week. Thanks for joining us, Dave, and uh, best wishes for round four. Thanks, mate.